next ambition we have, which is about building an intelligent cloud. With Azure and our servers, they form the core of this distributed computing fabric. The richness that is required from sub truly supporting hybrid computing to rich data services, application developer services. In fact, one of the core attributes or the core differentiators is productivity of developers in IT. These higher level capabilities that we have from our enterprise mobility suite to the operations management suite, our Visual Studio Online capabilities, they all come together so that you can, with agility, drive those application development projects and IT projects for your customers. We are the only vendor that's going to bring together, from an infrastructure level, three key attributes of hyperscale public cloud, hybrid, as well as the enterprise readiness. And we're going to do this with the openness and flexibility. You can write .NET apps and Java apps. You can run Windows, and you can run Linux. You can support the back end for any application across Windows Phone, Android, and iOS. You can manage the identities. You can manage data and protect that across all of those platforms. That level of flexibility and openness is what we want our backend infrastructure, our developer tools, to stand for. But the thing that I perhaps want to talk most about today is data. The key challenge or the key opportunity for any organization is to be able to convert data into intelligent action. In fact, the core intellectual property of any business going forward, the core currency of any business going forward, is their data. And the way to take advantage of it, of course, is to convert it into intelligence and, more importantly, intelligent action. And to do that, you have to walk through a series of stages. In fact, there are multiple questions that need to be asked and answered. You want to be able to find out what just happened, why it happened. You want to be able to predict things that may happen. And you want to get to automatically doing things because of your predictions. So we have taken all of the technology that we have underneath a lot of our own applications that we have built that exhibit these core analytic capabilities, Cortana, Bing and its web understanding, what we have done with vision and speech. And we took all of the big data infrastructure, machine learning, and all of that capability, and we are bringing it together in one suite called Cortana Analytics. This capability is what will help each one of you take very sophisticated technology and enable any business to transform themselves through the power of data. It's going to have core information management capabilities. That means you can harness all the data inside of your organization. It's going to have capabilities to store all this data in its native format. It can be big data. It can be non-SQL data, SQL data. You want to be able to process this using a variety of different mechanisms, stream analytics, machine learning, SQL, MapReduce. And then ultimately, you want to be able to interface all of that through something like Cortana or through automating of business processes. And one of the key things that we are trying to do, in fact, the way I think about this is when we were at the beginning of client-server, what really democratized client-server was innovation like Visual Basic. What is the moral equivalent of democratizing big data and advanced analytics? That's what led us to Cortana Analytics. And I want to talk about one organization, because this, I think, speaks to what's the potential. This is a small group that has a dream, and they want to use data to pursue that dream. Play, let's play the video. It's human 
nature to go as fast as you can possibly go. Oh, Lord. I'm not afraid of dying. I don't want to die, but I'm not afraid of it. I've been waiting for this moment for all my life. I just go, and I don't let up until I have to. On the Eagle, there's over 30 sensors. They gather almost 12 million points of data. We want to figure out the best way in which for this car to run. Enter the Microsoft Cloud. We're able to take the data, automatically process it, and get the results in a time frame that was unimaginable in the past. If you start thinking with fear, you're going to be living with fear, and you're not going to be achieving the goals that you set for yourself. Two things that I'm thinking before I take off. Let this be a testament that girls can do anything they set their mind to, and do not wreck this car. We're processing over 2,000 measurements a second, and that's where machine learning comes in. We're going to be able to try to find the correlations that are probably not obvious and drive this project to a greater extent than we ever could have dreamed. We will make history in 2015.